Hey there, Libra. I'm D. Let's play cards. All right, y'all. I can already tell this is going to be uh, enlightening, let's just say, just from the bottom of all the decks, which I'm going to flip over and not look at. All right? Someone's got a merry motive. I don't know. Someone's got a motive. All right. Nothing changes if nothing changes. Having to do with love, everyone just quiet. All right, let's see what's really going on. Libra, a fork in the road. Time to make a decision. Having to do with an abundance or to increase an abundance. Uh, right now, there's some sort of action. Oh, and then there's talking about fidelity and lovebirds. So let's see what's going on. Why, right? So we're talking about motives. I put it back. Here it is. That is about motives. Exchanging gifts, receiving, the law of giving and receiving, money, trades, the arts of the trades, the trade arts. I don't know, right? A contract. That is quite the contract right there. It's binding. Grace is an unforeseen gift from the universe. I don't know. Something's a gift. You're being gifted. Spiritually, maybe. Or because you're on your purpose, but I don't know, the devil's right there, so let's see. All right. Uh, uh, no. All right, what was that, the Ace of Pentacles? So let's see what's going on. It's time to make a decision, a major life change. What are these people's driving motives? Like what is going on? I feel like a lot of questioning here. Like, huh, this doesn't sound right. So somebody wants to hang out with you, Libra. They wanna be with you, be near you. Somebody feels maybe you're a blessing or vice versa. All right. He's not shuffling very nicely. Let's see. One more justice. One more shuffle. Oh, jeez. Oh, somebody's being difficult. Cut it out. All right, let's see what's going on. All right, what is this fork in the road here? The two of swords, a decision has to be made. That's what that is. That's an, uh, also an impasse or a stalemate or refusing to see something. The five of cups about the past here or somebody won't get over the past or move past the past. I don't know. What's this fork in the road, please? The three of cups. Mm -mm, spitting. The Queen of Wands is in reverse and the Three of Cups is in reverse. So some Leo fire sign is stuck, lacking confidence or courage. Uh, three of Cups in reverse can be overindulging, isolating uh, from an investment or from investing in something or from making a decision or sending a message or making a decision about sending a message. Because someone might be blocked or they feel blocked here. Yeah, nine of Pentacles, nine, nine, five of Swords. <clears throat> all right, what's all this here with the decision making and the aloneness? The Queen of Swords, upright. Uh, Libra, you said something here. I don't know, it made the sun reevaluate something or manifest in a different way or be practical. I don't know. Something you said made somebody think about something. What's this? The Nine of Cups about what they really want or about being selfish or uh, maybe somebody, what's that? Because it's the Page of Swords. So I do feel like the communication isn't quite right because that's young communication. But somebody could be watching also from a distance because they want something. They want the Ten of Pentacles and the Ace of Wands, stability, a lot of fives. What is all this uh, motives and shits 
Temperance, somebody wants to balance out a situation. Ten of Swords, the Devil, and the Ace of Cups, the King of Wands. Oh, boy. So definitely some fire sign, I don't know, isn't receptive, hasn't been receptive, now they want to take action, or, 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 let's see, the devil, I just put you back, Awa, justice and death. Somebody wants to change the way that the situation is going, however, that is the moon. Somebody is doing something, justice, magic to justice. In the dark, four of swords, eight of swords, to bring something to light. Two of cups, ten of cups. I feel like somebody like wants to celebrate you. Can I have another one? The eight of cups. I do feel like somebody is obsessed here or obsessing about how to Head in a direction to balance out the things here. Ten of Wands, Seven of Swords, because it's not right. That's not balance. The world in reverse, Chariot. So somebody definitely is trying to keep a cycle open. What's this right here? I've seen the King, Queen of Wands, and the King, and Queen of Swords. Eight of Swords, exchanging gifts. Like somebody... They can't exchange anything, strength. Somebody feels like they're losing their power or they have lost five of swords, nine of pentacles, because you're out doing your thing here. And it's quiet, five of pentacles. Somebody's definitely feeling the loss of the Libra. The tower or the other way around, 10 of swords. This ending is like really bothering this king of wands. What is this? Blessing, six of cups. So in the past, there was some sort of blessing here, two of swords. Uh, somebody's nostalgic about the past and something that they're looking at as a blessing. The knight of swords. And the two of pentacles. So in balance, in past, someone, I don't know, they didn't say the right thing. They didn't move correctly, Libra. Six of pentacles. Six, six, two, two. Five of Cups, Ace of Cups. Somebody is in deep regret here. Ace of Pentacles, Two of Wands. Somebody's making a choice here, like double choice. The Emperor, uh, it was the Lovers and the Two of Wands. Emperor's been holding that in Hermit, not saying anything at work or working hard or something like that. All right, let's see what's going on. Time. Detaching the sky, sudden and unexpected, stands the test of time. I don't know, somebody's trying to get a message across here. Libra, what's this card? The King and Queen of Cups. Communication, excitement, third party. Soulmates. Somebody's definitely been looking into something quietly. They feel like really connected, like they can't let themselves off the hook for something. I'm not really sure. Playing the field, a competition, uh, power struggles. The devil is out there. I told you somebody wants you uh, the magnet. Unique, uh, exquisite, shit. Problem solving with this partnership. And then there's the bear again and uh, a compass, so life path. Get on the right path, a transition, a change in traveling, moving. Someone could literally be moving. Go to guy or girl. So I don't know, y'all aren't talking to each other here. Let's see what else we got. Someone's trying to call someone in. universal laws that's what I'm saying somebody's trying to bring you back every action has an equal and opposite reaction that's that too it's a giving and receiving like one exchange for the other so I don't know you said something they weren't hermit you weren't hermit y'all blocking each other who the fuck knows 
someone's like, no, I'm not doing this. No, 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 this is not working for me. And you thought the grass was greener. So someone's like, all right, fuck it. If it's not working, it's not working. Don't let idiots ruin your day. No big deal. But apparently it is a big deal because someone's angry and they want to fix it. So uh, here we go with the money. All right, money's the root to all evil. P.S. you can't take it with you, just saying. Success isn't for the lazy. Somebody is, uh, works a lot. A lot, a lot. If it seems like someone's out to get you, they are. So there's that. Big breath. There's that. <sighs> Stupid's contagious. And it said, note your opinion of me does not affect my opinion of me. So whatever you said to this person, it's got them thinking about them. And you're like, well, whatever. Not my problem. I feel like this person don't want to change life. Bullies. Yeah, you said something to someone about life or I don't know. About evolving, about the meaning of life. Also, it looks like something is in mid transformation. So, definitely with the working a lot, belittling, a loner, isolating, which is what we said right there, anyways. And it says verbal abuse. So, Libra, you got a shop time, right? A big corporation. Yeah, there's all that work, work, work. Work and wealth, wealth and work, and the wealth and work are attached right to where it says money is the root of all evil. So, and then we get a spaceship, right and injustice. So I do like real fast, like when well, somebody wants to come at you like real fast. And, uh, uh, oh no, a firearm. And I don't know, maybe you'll get defensive to this person. But I also feel like you're being pushed together to resolve some sort of issue here, negotiation, the hotel, uh, again, with the casinos and taverns and do not disturb a luxury suite. Somebody wants to talk to you about the pros and cons. Yeah, they want to talk to you. I do feel like, so it says intimidate on there, so someone could be intimidating you or them or whomever. But again, with the alone and banishment, but somebody, I don't know, they want forgiveness. They've been hiding behind this theater, like pretending they don't care and shits like that. Or maybe they think you overreacted, Libra. Who the fuck knows, right? What's this? This is a secret life right there. So I don't know about the overreacting, but I do feel like this person wants to know uh, what you're doing. Surveillance, like what are you doing? And the snakes out here too, so maybe somebody is cold. Uh, I do feel like somebody is being dishonest with themselves, with others, whatever, uh, wanting to get away with something or somebody lets themselves get away with something. <sighs> somebody feels like they're untouchable or I don't know, like the shit don't bother them, but it does, surviving a disaster. Cause someone really desires I don't know, to be around you. Memory, that's all they can think about. A lot of wishing. Uh, this is motivation also. So someone is definitely, um, I don't know. They're having a meltdown with themselves here because they're not talking with all this silence. Uh, contract so explosive contract a temper so someone can have a temper Libra uh, resistance movement or collateral damage maybe this hurt you both <sighs> carnage I just yeah I just feel like whatever this is it's bothering the both of you and nobody's talking ace of cups the wolf like trust your trust your gnosis Bring it into light. Big, bold vision. I told you someone's making plans and trying to manifest divination. Could be getting tarot readings, watching tarot readings. That's what we're doing right now. Or somebody, uh, you know, they love that about you. Can I have another one? Or they know you're looking at them in your readings. Who the hell knows? A grand symphony. I don't know. Someone's about to do something grand. 
beyond the ordinary. That's what I'm saying. Candle magic, more magic. Are you doing magic? No, I'm not doing magic. Are you doing magic? For people. The veil. So I feel like suddenly someone can see something. They can feel things they couldn't feel before and they can't shake it. Come to life, like, I don't know, uh, conscious connection. So they can't, y'all can't, you're having a hard time separating because you can feel each other. This is uncharted territory, maybe for the both of you or at least one of you. Uh, that has a compass on it, but it's rocky also. The things that are bearing fruit, a merry motive, more motives in the broken open. It's happening for you, not to you. Uh, maybe somebody's trying to run into you, close encounters. Can I have another one? That's too many. Somebody's looking at themselves, seeing the true you, or maybe that's what you're doing, Libra, or somebody's looking at you. I don't know. Seeing the true you. Opening to discovery. It's something with a lock and a key and a door and the moving and... Birds of a feather. Awakening to genius. All of a sudden, somebody knows something. Intuition shining through. It's like you can't unsee it. The oracle's gift. You can't unhear it. Earth magic. You can't unsee any of it. The frog is a healer. Oh boy, so somebody definitely wants to get on the, the path, but they're, they're a little behind. And they're, they're observing and changing their mind. There's been some period of quietness, and then all of a sudden, here's this new life, and here's the boat with the uncharted territory. But this also says return to source. So, like I said, y'all, like, someone's trying to catch up. Not Rocky, Rocky. So here we go with the going backwards in order to go forward. So somebody, this whole situation, like stop, let's learn some lessons. And then this is all about interdependence, strength, building each other up, uh, togetherness. The magician's working on opening that door because they got a taste of prosperity. And now all of a sudden they're stuck looking, watching this healer of all ages. Uh, again, like some psychic or something. Again, with the psychic, that would be the Queen of Cups. Somebody's trying to send the messages here with Gabrielle about yin and yang. This man can't stop thinking about the shit and the soul contract here. Trying to stay grounded and clean things up. And uh, I do feel like, you know, trying to send out signs and synchronicities to call you back in here. Somebody feels like empty. Uh, and then there's a higher power. Because they weren't flexible, they weren't teachable, somebody was very rigid, but I also feel like be at the ready here, expect the unexpected, because now we're just back to where I started, uh, blossoming abundance. Someone's gonna fall from the sky, I guess. Like all of a sudden, this is shocking. Shocking, but I do feel like this person likes that, anyways. Shocking awe of things, they're extra. The successful warrior is the average man with laser like focus extra somebody's definitely ooh, focused on you libra are we good because i think i'm good right libra look somebody's trying to learn something about you divine intervention a breakup defeated inactive quiet here, oh, and there's the devil and the king of pentacles. Could be either or, but a man. He's just like, ugh. Wanting a new beginning with abundance and comfort and leisure. Wishes coming true. There's a lot of wishes. There's the proposal, Libra. It doesn't have to be, will you marry me, but something like that. What's that? A myth? A fairy tale? Oh, yeah, the whole thing is like a fairy tale. Quite the story. And creation gods in the middle. This is part of like the blueprint, your blueprint, and ah, archetypes, which are could be angels anyways. And then I got some wings and a psychic. So a metamorphosis, the average human with wings. And an enlightenment, telepathy, hermit. He's trying to talk telepathically, wishing for a miracle. I do feel like someone's looking out their window a lot, trying to see like someone's gonna pop up or something like that. 
<laughs> Somebody could live in an apartment building. Morality. That self-respect, commandments, free spirit, sins, an angel. Abstaining. So I just feel like this abstaining that this person is doing is driving them crazy. I feel like they're trying to like prove a point or I'm not really sure what they're doing, but uh, that says love. And it doesn't say rejection or anything like that. It does say infatuation and romance. Lost. Somebody feels lost at a crossroads. Somebody could be drunk. This millionaire out partying, doing things at this table, bribing, money. I don't know. Somebody feels like an idiot. Unfinished business. Feeling haunted here. Ugh. Tower. I do feel like uh, people at work might be noticing this about this businessman boss dude. So I feel like he's also up against some sort of time constraint with the missing person thing. If someone had to take a look in the mirror and figure out like, who are you? What do you want to do? Where do you want to be? And this person's like, well, I want to be blah, blah, blah. But a lot of changes have to come with that. Somebody's definitely watching voyeur surveillance out. I don't know, making sure you're not doing anything or going anywhere because that stresses them the fuck out. Yeah, they're burdened and baggage. Like, what is this person doing, Libra? Someone wants you to see them with the owl and the sun. Be aware of this man that you're the center of, like, I don't know, everything. Maybe he wants you to know that he's dependable or something but he's trying to get his point across it's not coming across in the tarot well maybe it is a little bit but it's not the same nor do i know okay who this is so libra it's about you right success is no accident it's hard work perseverance learning studying sacrifice and most of all love of what you do and are learning to do so i do feel like this whole spirituality thing is very new for whomever this is and now all of a sudden they got all these feelings and twinges and things that they don't even know what to do with. Don't ever accept an apology from someone that sucker punched you. Stupid's contagious. So you obviously had conversations with this person, moved on, right? Because you felt like you were being played. Somebody took all the liberties and now this someone is wanting to talk, speech. So you also hurt their feelings. Libra, you're not very nice. Kwan Yin usually hears the people's cries and says, don't worry, follow your heart, you're protected, all the shit's yours. If you've been wavering about proceeding with something that is dear to you, then this is the confirmation to just do it. So I guess somebody's just gonna just do it. I feel like they have learned a lot from you or you're learning a lot from them. So this is all about beauty, devotion, priestess, mystic, teacher. So spiritual leader and teacher, the unbound, releasing, releasing soul patterns, contracts, and past lives. So this person had to change something about something that they've always done to be able to be around you. Bring soul families and communities together. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Spread belonging, warmth, and oneness. Bring people to get, brings people together everywhere. Don't dim to fit in. How are you dimming your light in order to fit in? I do feel like that wasn't an option. So, you know, you no. Know, unbound, you yeah, know, we're not doing that. That the old Libra would do that. The, the heels new Libra, not so much. Prepares you to accept source healing. That's what I'm talking about. So it's time for someone else to heal and catch up. A pillar of light, your vibration is rising. Catching up. You are the oracle. Catching up to the oracle, to the teacher. <clears throat> All right. Good news. Good news is coming your way. Something beautiful is about to manifest. Feelings of elations like you're on a cloud. It's time to celebrate all the wonder and beauty of your life. So, birthing into a new age, which is... Uh, the year of Aqua the age of Aquarius, right? Birthing new creations and uh, dreaming the new world into being. You're all healers, part of this new world. What's crumbling? Just about everything. So what are you clinging to? So somebody is like has to get over their old shit. 
basically. Hold your vision. Somebody's stuck watching you that can't help it. Or you're doing this to someone, right? It can go vice versa. Spiritual discipline is needed. All right. And Kwan Yin's Pink Dragon, which we just talked about. Or in the other one. Oh, they, whatever. Brings love and resets karmic balances. See all the cords dissolved by transcending love. Enjoy your freedom. Look for the divine around you. So lots of things are changing with lots of people around you, quite honestly. Angel over me, and there's the wings answering the call. So I do feel like you're being blessed with this. I mean, you can't get anything for nothing. The universe is going to make you work for it. But there's some blessing coming in that didn't start out so easy, but it's getting better. It will be better. It's part of your purpose. It's supposed to be there. I don't know. Transformation. You just got to wait for it. Anywho, you're doing a lot of waiting this last year, I'll tell you. A proposal. All right. I'm good. Bye.